Hey, good morning guys. It's 7.30 in the morning and uh, I slept okay last night. Um, although I woke up, say, a little bit before 7. Um, and I haven't, well, uh, about 6.30. Uh, and I haven't been able to get to sleep again because uh, this road is real busy and uh, the cars started hauling butt, uh, by about that time. But here's where I ended up parking. And uh, San Francisco is shockingly easy to stealth camp in. I was really surprised. Um, I got to get going though because uh, where I'm parked, I'm not allowed to park uh, after 8 a.m. But uh, there's a Westphalia over there. That's pretty cool. Um, so it ended up being a good night and uh, overall. Uh, I wish I could have gotten a little more sleep, which if I had come here a little earlier, you can, I can start parking here at 9 p.m. So I could have got more sleep out of it. But uh, um, that's the positives and the negatives anyways. So I'm going to head off over and grab a shower at 24 Hour Fitness. Talk to you later, guys. Dang guys, this this stuff is way more expensive here in uh, San Francisco. We're talking like 40, 50% more. The off brand and it was still 11 bucks for this little tiny box. So anyways, I'll probably use this up in a week or if not less. I'm uh, walking down to uh, the pier now, um, right off of Powell right now, and uh, gonna go check out uh, Pier 39. And uh, I might go over to the Fisherman's Wharf in the daytime a little bit too, because I just spent pretty much a little bit of time in the night over there yesterday. Um, and then when I'm done over here on Pier 39, I'm gonna head over to Chinatown and. Uh, eat at this restaurant that uh, Scott had suggested to me so I'm gonna film the place for him I guess he has some really good memories he'd like to have uh, in video <laughs> I've often wondered what it would be like to live full time off your boat. Just rent a slip and hang out there and go and enjoy the bay anytime you want to or let's say it was the river, whatever works for you and stuff. Are there any uh, people over here uh, that have subscribed to this channel or are watching me that maybe uh, do that and you know live out of their boat? If there are, can you please uh, um, put some comments down below you know let me know what you think of it and uh, kind of sure what, what are the uh, positives and negatives I'd appreciate that thanks guys bye bye hey guys check out the huge Christmas tree apparently uh, they light it right after Thanksgiving oh well, guys I'm headed back to the van uh, my uh, time should have just about expired on the uh, meter here. So I'm gonna go and uh, head on over to Chinatown and uh, check out a restaurant This one of my subscribers named Scott suggested, and then just feel out Chinatown, see what it's like. Talk to you guys later. Back over here at the van, guys. So uh, let's see if the toll expired on here.
Yep, looks like I'm expired. Bad monkey, no ticket yet. Time to take off. <laughs> San Francisco's got duck tours as well. This looks quite old. I wonder what that building was. Probably a fire department. Houston's trying to do this uh, fill-in with townhomes. Kind of a mimic of this, but uh, I think the architecture in these is much nicer than what Houston's doing. And they should uh, try to mimic the architecture here a lot more than uh, they are there in Houston. Nice downhill view, though. Coit Tower's over there off to the left. I think I might go and try to see it. Turn right onto Mason Street. Turn left onto Pacific Avenue. In 500 feet, turn left onto Washington Street. San Francisco's a very unique city turn with all the train Street, lines running right, right down the road and the electric lines right right along here. Um, I haven't been in a city that looks like this before. Here I am, Scott, over here at 667, not 687, at the Golden Flower. So I'm gonna go in here and order lunch. Hey Scott, so here's the menu today. There you go, man. So that's what the menu looks like today. And uh, I'm gonna order something up. Talk to you in a bit. Here you go, Scott. So uh, I'm having a full combo, full and uh, medium sized and uh, some tea here, some green tea. So I look forward to enjoying. This round eye is almost done, brother. Enjoying it, Scott. Cheers, Scott. Hope you're enjoying uh, Texas. Hey Scott, that was a good, some good foe man over there and uh, I'm gonna go and enjoy the rest of Chinatown. Talk to you later buddy. <laughs> That's one way to decorate a van, huh? <laughs> Walking through Chinatown, I was handed this pamphlet, and uh, I don't know if anybody had been hearing anything about this, but uh, this is pretty messed up if you ask me. If you have any details on this more. 
If you uh, have any uh, details on this, maybe you could uh, in, put them in the comments below because uh, it's kind of messed up to me. Here's a pretty cool mural. I thought I'd stop and show you all. It has the Chinese zodiac signs, I guess you would say, and uh, or Eastern. Um, they're not specifically only to China, but uh, I happen to be a horse. This is my year. Which year is yours? I'd like to know what year uh, your. Uh, go find out what your Chinese sign is and. Uh, Post it below. all done over here at Chinatown uh, would have liked to have been a little bit longer but uh, I have to get going if I'm gonna have a chance to go by Coit Tower uh, uh, the hippie part of town uh, near Lower Height and uh, swing through the uh, Golden Gate Park area so I'll talk to you in a few guys and uh, I'll try to get some video going by the uh, Coit Tower. Bye. You know what? Get out there, guys. Connect with people. Live your lives. And let other people live theirs. Peace.